What happens after ovulation if you are pregnant? If the egg was fertilized by a sperm cell when you ovulated, the fertilized egg will transform into a zygote. Eventually, the zygote will travel down the fallopian tubes, making its way to becoming a marola or a blastocyst. This is the beginning stage for an embryo. How do you know you have conceived after ovulation? Some women may notice symptoms as early as 5 DPO, although they won't know for certain that they are pregnant until much later. Early signs and symptoms include implantation bleeding or cramps, which can occur 5 to 6 days after the sperm fertilizes the egg. Other early symptoms include breast tenderness and mood changes. How many days after ovulation does discharge dry up? A person may be able to stretch the fluid an inch or more between their fingers. Post-ovulation days 14 to 22, after ovulation, the body releases the hormone progesterone, which dries up cervical fluid. The discharge may look cloudy at first, then become thicker. What indicates that conception has occurred? Some women do notice signs and symptoms that implantation has occurred. Signs may include light bleeding, cramping, nausea, bloating, sore breasts, headaches, mood swings, and possibly a change in basal body temperature. What happens after conception day by day? By Connie Matheson under normal circumstances, fertilization occurs in one of the fallopian tubes, then the fertilized egg begins to make its way to the uterus. By about the fifth day after conception, the embryo finally reaches the uterus, where it implants itself in the endometrium, or uterine lining. How many days post-ovulation did you get a positive? This implantation usually occurs 6 to 10 days after ovulation. Then you have to wait for hormone levels to rise high enough to be detected on a pregnancy test. The earliest you can test for pregnancy is 7 DPO. Days past ovulation, our Emma's Diary Week by Week Pregnancy Guide starts at week 1. Don't forget to subscribe for more of these videos.